What's up, you guys? There's a message coming through. Where someone, what I'm hearing is that someone is learning how to discern. Where somebody's learning how to tell when somebody switches. So I don't really know what that means yet, but we'll find out. I have kind of an idea. I get like little flashes. Well, let's see. I think it's like somebody can tell when people are shifting in and out of like the third and fifth dimension or like shifting in and out of like certain frequencies. Like you can tell by verbiage if you're shift if you're in third, if you're in, um, in the 3D versus like the 5D because like the 5D is more about like commanding um, and the 3D is more of like um, like questioning. So if you find yourself like doing a lot of questioning then you're, you're kind of, I wouldn't say like stuck in 3D but that's that would be indicative of like a 3D energy whereas if you're like in 5D um, it's like what I'm hearing is speaking more of like the future you know, it's constant manifesting. It's, that's the kind of language, right? So I feel like maybe somebody is learning how to discern, like, who is in the 3D and who's in the 5D because somebody is in between. I mean, we're, if you, I mean, yeah, so. What's the message, please? Ancestors of the High Light. So there was like a genesis with regards to this process and it's something about your like empathy. First you could feel it, but now you're, this is interesting. Okay. So it's like the universe is trying to prove it to you. It's like first you could feel it and you just knew it. Okay. So somebody is, um, like you're claircognizant, uh, or, um, clairvoyant no that's when you can see anyways it's anyways it's like you could feel all right so you're very empathic with the, the queen of cups here so like um you could feel it first um and then your guides would like explain it to you later or something like that or like you just knew um so like when you were in the 3d you would feel like unhappy and sad when you were like around these certain types of people and and then it's like you would be in like 5d scenarios where you would feel like really good like your body would just feel just you feel very zen and at peace and you know um you could be like in the shittiest situation and you'd still just be like you got it right so it's like something about like somebody's guides kind of like it was like a slow initiation process for you to be able to like witness this so, so this is okay so this is somebody some something is somebody's learning somebody's ancestors are teaching somebody something to, to be able to better navigate themselves in in the world what else spirit ancestors of highest my light also discern higher frequencies that are um, like people who are 5D who are um, who are not supposed to be there who are using the knowledge who are using 5D knowledge on the 3D to manifest false realities I'm also hearing you're also learning how to discern that This is with the High Priestess and the Queen of Cups and the Eight of uh, Pentacles in the reverse position. That's the message. That's what I'm hearing, okay? This is making it easier for you to, like, know, like, where you belong, so to speak, okay? So, but I, I want to make sure, and, and to avoid, like, sticky situations is what I'm hearing, okay? That's what I have with the Ten of Pentacles. 
the chariot in the reverse position with the six of uh, swords in the reverse position, okay? It's like, I feel like you have been, like, or like your guides have, like, seen you've been burned so many times. It's almost like your guides, your ancestors had to, like, open you up to this knowledge. So this is going to help you uh, exponentially in the future. Yeah, you might be, like, in the planning stages of something right now with regards to a passion project. You might be waiting for something to, like, get off the ground, so to speak. So I feel like this this process, this was waiting. This this is kind of what your guides wanted you to to kind of go through. This is going to help, or maybe having done this opened up like a higher level of something. I'm not saying that whatever anybody went through, you had to go through this. You did not. But but you, you know, you're. I think that. This was just kind of like a little side thing. I think that this was happening to somebody, but it's, this is just something that has now been illuminated. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so like you'll stay away from like low vibing, like emotionally manipulative, like jerks. It's like you're just not going to be fucked with anymore. Spirit ancestors of the nice light. So there was another message that was coming through. There was something else. Someone may have learned this through their their family too. This might be. Like somebody's detoxing. Somebody needs to like liven up or freshen up their energy. Um somebody. So it's like the next step is um so when you are when you can identify when you're around these types of like three D I just heard buffoons. <laughs> that was not me. But when you hear, when you are around these these energies, it's important then for you to cleanse your energy. So like that's the up. Uh, that's that's what you have. That's the that's the money right there that you have. The secret weapon. Like a lot of people just go home and they think like, oh my god, I have a migraine. You know, after hanging out with, they don't know that you know somebody's. Um, you know, got a 3D brain and, you know, tr using language that's trying to manifest some shit and or just being around, you know, like some people just don't really pay attention to that stuff, but you are like hyper aware of this now, so to speak. Um, this might be disheartening though. I just saw the fool in the reverse position. So it's like, this is depressing and sad almost, but it's like, don't give up hope. Don't, that would be so sad. It is like sad to know that shit you know what I mean like and it's angry it'd make me angry too it's like how can you live yeah no I get that it's like somebody has have you ever seen the movie they live I'm pretty sure that's the name of the movie but it's like this 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 guy finds out that like everybody is like aliens and he can put on these glasses and he can see them and it's like it it just it turns the world in from from being like um it's like you see things differently yeah you can see the dark empaths and the psychic vampires and the bullshit so you can get the fuck out of there <laughs> And release yourself from third-party situations. I don't know what the Three of Cups is in the reverse position. Some sort of, like, gossip. Some bullshit. That, like, you can release yourself from situations now. So that's... You're a free spirit. See, I don't even think that you... Had to know how to do this before. Because I think that you have been doing this for so many lifetimes. 
that it's just natural, but it's like something happened where like now you're like hyper aware. You've been hyper aware, or you have been made. sees you coming. Nobody sees you coming. Oh, that's the other thing. People expect you to not know. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's like that movie and they live. It's like the, the people, the aliens don't know that this dude can see them with these glasses on. Um, he has to pretend like he can't see them, too. So, because if he pretends like he can see them, then they act different, and then they can telepathically, like, communicate with each other, or something like that, where it's like, yeah, it's, it's kind of like, it's kind of like Inception, too, I guess, in that regard. Or maybe I'm getting those two parts confused, but I'm pretty sure that that's what it is. It's like, yeah, he's like, yeah. But it's like, um... It's like they don't see you coming. They don't expect you to see them. They don't, I just heard they don't expect you to care. Probably because they don't care. See, that's the devil energy projecting onto light workers. It just never works for the devil, man. Because, like, the, it's like, that's why love prevails. here whatever you're working on like you have the upper hand you got this soft strength nobody sees you come in like you just fly right above the chaos it's like you you can kind of like see it all but I don't see it like as like an elitist way I see it more like and I don't even see you like flying above the radar so to speak I almost see you like kind of like ducking and diving you know like that's actually what I see so but it, but so like in the physical, that's kind of like what I see. But like in the in the spiritual, in your soul is like soaring above the bullshit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's the reading. I hope that this helps. Just stay positive, okay? Sending you guys so much love. Um, that's the fucking truth, okay? This is this is a beautiful reading. All right, love you guys. Thanks so much for being here. Until next time.